Today for our math strategies video, we're going to be talking about understanding the equal sign. So this is from Ready Math Lesson 10. So we'll be working with picture models, number bonds, 10 frames to show equal amounts on both sides of the equal sign. Remember that the equal sign means the same as. So let's take a look at this number bond first. And if my hole is four, okay, and if I have a part of three and a part one, okay, I can create a number sentence with this and a number sentence using the equal sign. So looking at this number bond right here, I could say three plus one equals four, or three and one together mean the same as four, okay? All right, so let's try another one using that equal sign. Okay, this time, we're going to be using the whole five okay so if I have a part two and a part three I can create a number sentence using the equal sign okay so I know that two and three together equal five or two plus three are the same as five okay I could also write this another way using that equal sign. I could start with my whole, put my equal sign, and say two plus three. So this would say five equals two plus three, or five is the same as two plus three. Okay, so let's take a look at some other problems using that equal sign. All right, so let's say we have three, one and then one plus three. So looking at this number sentence right here, um, is the, are they equal? Is three and one together equal the same as one and three? Let's see. So if I have three and one, it gives me four. Okay, so if I have one and three, it gives me four. And I know that four is equal to four or is the same as four, okay? Let's look at another problem here. This time we're going to say three is the same as one plus three, okay? So I know on this one right here, I have three circles. And on the other side of the equal sign, I have one circle and three more circles, okay? So I know that this is three equals four, but I know that three and four are not the same. They do not equal each other. Four is more. So I cannot use the equal sign there, okay? All right, let's look at one more problem here, okay? And we're gonna try to see if they are equal. So let's do one plus nine. and seven plus three, okay? So, I'm gonna take a look at some 10 frames on this. And so I have one plus nine, and then I have my three and my seven, okay? So, I know that nine and one together give me a total of 10, and I know that because I filled up a 10 frame, okay? And then I know that three and seven together give me 10 because three and seven are number partners for the number 10. So nine plus one equals 10 and three plus seven equals 10. So I know these equations do equal each other because 10 is the same as 10 or 10 is equal to 10. 